Okay, so how to make a holiday gift finder quiz on Octane AI and add it to your Shopify store. It's super, super easy. I'm going to show you how to do it. Let's see how fast we can go. Let's do this. Okay, so first up, this is my store, Be The Cozy. It's amazing. I stole some products and put them up here. I don't actually sell these. Uh, but my pretend store, we're selling beanies and candles. And I feel like when people shop, this season uh, to find a gift, uh, maybe they don't know what their friend wants or their family member wants or their spouse wants. So let's add a quiz with Octane that helps them figure out what they should buy. If you don't have Octane yet, this is the first step. So just go to the Shopify app store and search Octane and you will find Octane AI. You can add it, 14 day free trial, really, really easy. Okay, once you have Octane, the next step is to go create a new quiz. So create new quiz. We're gonna start from scratch, but there's a lot of templates that you can choose from. So this one will start from scratch. Quiz name, let's say holiday gift finder, and we're going to choose dynamic, okay? All right, quiz is set up. So let's start editing it. So what is your first question? Um, let's see, what should we have for our first question? Well, the first thing we want to know is uh, who are you shopping for? And possible answers are myself, maybe you're shopping for yourself, getting yourself a little secret gift, or two, um, someone else. This is really helpful because this data can all get synced to your email platform later, so if you want to email people differently, uh, afterwards, based on if they're shopping for themselves or for someone else, you can now do that because you've collected this great data. Um, let's add another question, multiple choice. This question is going to be, what is uh, your price range? Oops, can't spell price range for this gift. And then we're just going to keep this really simple. You could do more. Let's say under $50 is going to be one of them. And then the other one is going to be $50 or more. Now, here's what we want to do here. I tagged my products in my Shopify store, uh, whether they were under $50 or over $50. And what we're going to do is we're going to connect these buttons to the tags so that at the end of the quiz, it's going to show products based on the price they actually are. So for under $50, we're going to say, uh, one, let's make this a key question so that the results at the end actually match whatever we uh, set here. So under $50, let's say tag under $50. So now that's connected. Okay, and then let's go to $50 or more. Select tag, $50 or more. And so this means that when someone takes the quiz and they choose this, at the end of the quiz, it's only going to show them products on my store that are over $50 or under $50. Okay, let's go add a, let's drag this up to the second one here. So we want that to be the second question they get. And then, okay, the next thing we want to do is what is your email? So we already have this. This is already in here. This is perfect. We could say, we could give you a discount code maybe if you sign up here, but I'm not gonna do that. And then calculating results. So this is what it's gonna show when it's actually thinking of what product to show them. I'm gonna just type in finding you the perfect gift. And then we could actually put a little GIF here if you have one. I'm just gonna go to Giphy real quick and you could find something much better than this. I'm gonna just say searching. Uh, okay, we'll just use this one. This is not the most holiday most holiday gift, but this is the one I'm going to use. You could probably find something much, much better. Okay, and then I'm going to say top content, add content, image, upload. Put the GIF in there. Okay, and then great. Okay, this is the result. So now I'm gonna click the results page here, dynamic results page. And here is, uh, we found you some perfect gift options. Make this holiday special. Okay, and then these products are, are going to dynamically fill up based on what they chose as the price. 
I'm going to choose to show, let's say, six products. Okay. And then we'll sort them by best selling. And that's basically it. So I'm going to save this. And the whole, the whole thing is set up. Now, if we wanted to make this even fancier, like let's say we wanted to add an image on the left side, for example, we could go ahead and do that now. Let's say design, side image, add image, and I have a good one here. Okay. Um, go back. Go back. And then let's just do that for each of these. So we're going to go add a quick side image to each of them. We'll just do the same one. You could do different ones if you wanted to. But I'm going to do the same one just to keep it really simple. Side image, add image. Okay. And then the final one, finding the perfect gift. We'll just keep that as there. It doesn't need a side image for that. And then for uh, design settings, I'm actually, instead of centering everything, I'm going to make it left aligned. Okay. You know what? Uh, let's see. Find your perfect gift. Let's actually put a side image on this one too. Okay, here we go. Great, save. This is like, could be a lot better, but it's good enough. Okay, so we've made the quiz. That's great. Now we want to put it on the website. So save and publish. Uh, we can put it in a pop-up on the store really, really easily, but I'm going to put it on a Shopify page. So let's go do that. And here I can make an embed code that either gets embedded into a page or it can be full screen. I'm going to make it uh, embedded into the actual page. So I'm going to copy this. Done. I'm going to go over to my Shopify store real quick over here. Okay. Go back to here. I'm going to go to my pages. I already set up a page, holiday gift finder. We're going to go drop in the code, save it, view the page. Boom. Okay. Now our quiz is here. This is really great. And I can say, who am I shopping for? Let's say someone else. What is your price range? Mm, let's say $50 or more. What is your email? My email is matt at octanei.com. Submit. Finding you the perfect gift. Now it's looking for the gift. Boom. Here we go. All the products that are over $50. I can add them to my cart right now and I can check out. This is this is great, we're done. Now, what would be really good is if we could add a section to the home page here uh, that featured the quiz. So we can go into our store, we can customize it. I set up a little thing here, we can turn it on. This is very common that you would feature something like this at the top of your website. Go back here, check it out, refresh, boom. Now, every time somebody comes to the store, they can really easily go take the holiday gift finder and find that special someone the perfect gift and all this data that is collected is also synced right to their email where they can send the products that were recommended and follow up emails to make sure that customer ends up really happy. So this is how you make a holiday gift guide with Octane AI and add it to your Shopify store. Uh, there's a lot more things you can do with it but this is the really really fast version that honestly can help any store that, that doesn't have one. Let us know if you have any questions. We are here to help through the holiday season and I hope you have a really great Black Friday and Cyber Monday and the rest of the year.